Hi, I'm Ben Glass, CEO and CTO of Alteros. We founded Alteros because we realized there's, there's really not a good solution for rural infrastructure, a lot of the challenges that rural communities and businesses face. Alteros's core product is centered around what we call a super tower. It's basically an autonomous aerostat or tethered blimp. Aerostats have been around for decades. They've been used by militaries and governments around the world. Great track record for lifting heavy payloads for long periods of time. The thing that sets Alteros' aerostats or super towers apart is that we've been able to bring modern control, modern automation to the aerostat platform. The SD Flex is our newest super tower product. It's a portable, rapidly deployable, autonomous aerostat. The SD Flex, as you can see, is mounted on a trailer, which allows us to tow it to a deployment site very easily and set it up in about a day. At the core of Alteros' super tower is what we call Aerostat Autopilot. So this is the suite of software that essentially replaces the human crew needed uh, to, to operate traditional aerostats. So Aerostat Autopilot has a few layers of automation. We have the low-level controllers that you would find in, in most equipment. So this is the uh, control that is managing the operation of the winches, the slew drive, uh, the pressure management system, all of the actuators of the system. But where it gets really interesting is sort of above that low-level control layer, we have what we call AI Flight Director. This is essentially the pilot of the airplane. It's what is flying the aerostat, taking in all of the, the data to determine um, how to control the winches, how to control the slew, to keep the platform very stable, very steady, at, the, at a constant altitude and constant attitude. Above the AI flight director is another layer of, aut of autonomy, what we call the automated dispatch control, or ADC. The ADC is, is much like the air traffic control at an airport. So it's making the decision to fly, to land, what altitude to fly at, essentially based on the weather, the state of the, the system, the mission requirements. All of this information is, is being brought into the system. ADC is processing that in real time to make the best possible decisions to keep the system safe and to maximize the mission availability. So the reason Aerostat Autopilot is such a game changer for Aerostats is because it's, it's really the key piece that allows us to uh, really broaden the set of applications that Aerostats can be used for. Again, traditional Aerostats require a very large crew to operate them. That crew is required to be on site 24 seven. So it ends up being very expensive to uh, keep a traditional Aerostat in the air. In addition, that crew introduces a lot of human error in operating the system, which is one of the biggest drivers of downtime and lost mission availability. So the reason Aerostat Autopilot is so exciting is that it, el it eliminates both the cost and the performance impact of having that large crew on site. With Aerostat Autopilot, we're able to reduce the cost of operating an Aerostat system by up to an order of magnitude. In addition, customers in the communication space or other commercial and industrial applications uh, can, for the first time, leverage the unique capabilities of an aerostat platform to lift equipment much higher than a tower can reach for long periods of time and to lift a lot more mass and provide a lot more power than you can get out of a traditional drone or most other aerial platform applications.